YouTube channel. The purpose of this video is to know what to do about water sprouts or suckers that are growing in your mesquite or Palo Verde. First, it should be noted that there are other reliable online sources that say to promptly remove water sprouts or suckers. This is true. However, in this case, we're dealing with sprouts and suckers that are growing in mesquites and Palo Verdes that have had their lower and middle canopy removed. Lower and middle canopies are important to any tree for two reasons. Firstly, because all the branches on the tree serve as vibration dampeners. And what is wind? To a tree, it's vibration. So when you have a lower canopy, that helps to absorb vibration that would otherwise go out to top limbs damaging them. Secondly, the lower canopy, the further and further down you go on the lower canopy, serves to absorb nutrients from the sun for the entire tree in lower and lower light conditions. And those conditions happen in dusk and dawn, basically six hours a day. And if there's cloud cover for a whole day, that's uh, uh, for the entire day, 24 hours, that the tree could be missing out on absorbing nutrients from its lower canopy. So how do we deal with sprouts? Firstly, if we remember that the sprouts are the tree's response to having had the lower canopy removed, it's trying to regain its lower canopy. This tree was lion-tailed, lion-tailing, basically uh, skinny, skinny, skinny with a poof at the end, basically the lower canopy, all the branches have been taken off of the leaders. This tree had about 30 or 32 sprouts to start with about a month ago. Essentially, we look for the sprouts that are going to a good space, a functional space, because we still don't want it on the roof or in the walkway, but we also want it to take up a nice open space somewhere in the Mesquite or Palo Verde that it's going to have room to grow. Some of these remain, about 15 of them from the original 32. So right now I'm going to take off about uh, maybe three or four more, still leaving the ones that are in a, a good spot to grow in a good space. Uh, I'll take off one of these, leaving one of them. Uh, this one right here, you know what, I'll make a little reduction cut on this one so that I subordinate it from what I think I'm going to keep because this looks like a nice sprout that might grow into a nice lower canopy. Uh, in about three weeks, I'll revisit this again and I might take out a half more, taking out the ones that don't seem like they're working out and leaving the ones that look like they're going to good spaces. Essentially, the name of the game is to regain and nurture the lower canopy, knowing the importance of a lower canopy to a tree. If you want to learn more about mesquites and Palo Verdes, please go to our website where you could find our video on the products page, Mesquites and Palo Verdes, a homeowner's guide. Thanks for watching and please subscribe. Please go to RomeoTreeService.com to download Mesquites and Palo Verdes, a homeowner's guide.